Zelensky warned U.S. lawmakers about military aid. Ukrainian President Volodymyr Zelensky has pegged his nation's continued fight against Russia to sustained U.S. military assistance, according to U.S. Senate Majority Leader Chuck Schumer. There was a single sentence that summed it all up, and I am quoting him verbatim. Mr. Zelensky said, If we don't get the aid, we will lose the war, the lawmaker told journalists after meeting Zelensky on Capitol Hill. The Biden administration has requested an additional $24 billion in spending for Ukraine, but this proposal faces resistance from Republican lawmakers. A group of over two dozen Republican senators and representatives sent a letter to the White House expressing concerns about the allocation of funds and seeking clarification on the progress of the counteroffensive. The American people deserve to know what their money has gone to. How is the counteroffensive going? The letter read. The message was penned after Biden officials briefed Congress behind closed doors about their plans for Ukraine. Senator Josh Hawley, a skeptic on the White House's policy, said the executive branch wanted indefinite funding with no clear path to a Ukrainian victory. What was it? 24 billion? That is not the end. They made it very clear. It's not close to the end, he said of the briefing. What we are basically told is buckle up and get out your checkbook. While bipartisan support for funding the Ukraine war remains intact, House Speaker Kevin McCarthy has faced resistance within his party, according to US media. During its summer ongoing counteroffensive, the Ukrainian military has encountered strong Russian resistance. Both the Zelensky government and the White House have shifted their messaging to emphasize slow but steady progress in the long term.